Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're doing our chip swap upgrade. I have here a, uh, it's a WA20P, it's version 9.18. The version that we currently have is 2.5. So with that version, you're not able to do any total connect. So what we're going to do is we're going to remove the old EEPROM chip and we're going to install the new EEPROM chip. So hopefully you can kind of see, it's tough to see in here, the top right and the bottom left, there is a little gap that you can fit either a paper clip or as you can see what I'm using here is just a little bent, just a little pin tool. I don't know what they call this, but it's a little sharp edge. And basically what you do, of course, power down the panel first. Battery, transformer, kill power totally to the system. What you're going to do is you're just going to put the top right, pry it out, and then again, the bottom left, pry it out. And don't fight it. It's pretty delicate, so. Now once you have the old chip out, we're going to take the new one, and it's going to go in the same way. So once it feels the grooves, it slides right in, quick and easy. So now what we just did is we saved the homeowner some money by getting the chip swap upgrade communicator uh, so we didn't have to replace the whole board to do what he wanted to do. So again, power the system down, top right, bottom left, pry out, pry out. They actually have a uh, retraction tool, I believe they call it. Uh, I saw a bunch of them online for $299, $399, but you saw how easy that was with a homemade tool like that. So that's it. That's the chip swap upgrade.